Okay, guys. Now, these were gang members, so it was a good idea for me to remember their names. My thought was that they'd be less likely to kill me if I used their names when we talked. There are only four of them, so it'd be simple. Piece of cake. Here goes. Remember them with me. Okay. Tell me your names. My name is Dante Leroy. Dante? Dante or Aunt Dante? Yeah. We can say nicknames. Yeah, you can say your nicknames. Oh, Crisis. Crisis? <laughs> Crisis Deuce. <laughs> Crisis Deuce. My name is PK Nut. PK Nut? Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Why are you called PK Nut? Power Killer. Power Killer? Power Killer Nut. Okay. PK Nut Deuce, you know. Power Killer Dow Bash. Mm -hmm. And what's yours? Little PK J Dub Compton, I mean, blah. <laughs> so you all go PK? Yeah. So I can that makes I'm it easy. Though. That makes it. Turkey murderer. TJ? TK. TK. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> PK and, and TK. Okay, you guys. I'm not gonna better remember all this. <laughs> okay, you guys in a gang? Yeah, we do. We gang bang. I'm a block. Ever use a gun? Yeah, we use a gun. Yeah. Scary? Yeah, it's scary. You been shot at? Yep. Several more than once. All that. Seven O's, you know what I'm saying? But you know, they caught me on Compton Boulevard, though. It ain't nothing. Just a block still. You guys, too? You been shot at? Yeah, I've been shot at and all that. I've been through all the right. worst. Been in jail three times, man. Nothing to me. Staggering yeah, the Same thing. Been in th jail three times. We got bust that out right here in by the, the nasties, you know. We neck bone murder squads. So you use a gun? Yeah, I use a gun. It's nothing. You ever shot at someone? No. Nah, I never shot at nothing. They don't ask you all them kind of type of I never shot at nothing. Set up. Yeah? Huh? What's up? Huh? Okay, you yeah, yeah, scared of dying? Yeah, everybody's scared to die, but it's nothing, though. I ain't mean, gonna be scared, like, to be really scared about it, but I'm scared to die. I ain't gonna let nobody know that. You know, yeah. I never show nobody that I'm scared to die. It's the block, forever. What about you guys? You ever think about dying? <laughs> Man, I don't think about Man. dying, man. Man, hey, just go see me. Okay, okay. Here's a big question for you. What happens after you die? Where do you go? I guess to heaven, you know what I'm talking about? I ain't never trying to go to hell, but it really don't matter right now. We on earth right now. We ain't thinking about when we gonna die. So, so you think you'll go to heaven? Yeah, I think I will, because I do everything I need to do. As long as I ain't never killed nobody in my life, I can do what I need to do. Think you're a good person? Yep. I know I'm a good person. Most every man will proclaim his own goodness. Proverbs chapter 20, verse 6. Okay. Let me ask you some questions and see if it's true, okay? I'm going to be really straight with you. Yeah, straight. Can you handle that? Yeah. Have you ever told a lie? No, nope. but yeah, I mean, everybody told a lie. Whoever. Okay, now what do you call if you tell a lie? What would you call me if I told a lie? You a liar. Mm -hmm. Have you ever stolen something? Yes, I stole something. Folk. Okay, what does that make you? A thief. Uh -huh. <laughs> Have you ever used God's name in vain? Yeah. Okay, like that's, called, that's called blasphemy. It's very serious in God's sight. It's using your Creator's name as a cuss word to express disgust. It's called blasphemy. And here's the last one. You guys listen to this. This is a real important one. This will nail you to the wall. Jesus said, whoever looks at a woman to lust after her has committed adultery already with her in his heart. Yeah. Have you ever looked at a woman with lust? Yeah. Like okay. looked at her like this, like? Yeah, like, you know, Like sexually. that, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I... Okay. Yeah. You, you're not supposed to do that or something? So, you, T, TJ? Yeah. TJ. Jesus said no, you... TK. TK. Okay, yeah. TK. You commit adultery in your heart in God's eyes when you do that. It's very bad. So listen to this, TK. By your own admission, you're a lying, thieving, blasphemous, adulterate heart, and you have Man. to face God on Judgment Day. Man. So if He judges you by the Ten Commandments on the Day of Judgment, do you think you'd be innocent or guilty? Guilty. Would you go to heaven or hell? Hell. Now, does that concern you that if you died today, you'd end up in hell forever? Yep, I'll be thinking about that sometime, but I'm still going to rock. I mean, if it was a way you can get out the game bang, and I would have been did it. I'm already in it, so it's too far. To, I'm already too far to go back. Yeah, but that's not your problem. It's sin that's your problem. It's it's your relationship with God. If you get right with God, He'll make a way for you to get out. I know, I try, but I mean... You know, you need a new heart. Yeah. What's dwelling in within you is what's in all of us. It's called sin, and it's evil, and it'll take you to hell, and I don't want that to happen to you. You don't want to go to hell. Doesn't it concern you that you go to, if you die today, you go to hell? Yep, I always think about that. I think about that every day when I'm by myself. Did you hear that? He said, I think about that every day when I'm by myself. What unexpected honesty of heart. Oh man, please think about it. Did you know what God did for you so you wouldn't have to go to hell? Yep, died on the cross for us. Well, you know that. Yep. Well, what are you going to do? I'm going to do the same thing he did for us. Well, you got to repent and trust him because he poured his life's blood out for you. I mean, but it, look. 
I know how you feel about all this God stuff, but evidently it was it was meant for me to do this. Cause if it wasn't it, I wouldn't be here right now. Yeah, but so it was meant for me to game, man. It was meant for me to be from this hood, cause God meant for me to do this. Okay. I mean, if He say this and this and that about don't do nothing else, I mean, I mean, it says God wore the whole world, so evidently He made me do this. Yeah, but think of this. Could you stand in front of a judge and say, God made me rob that person? He's not going to let you off because you, you blame God. You can't yeah. blame God for your sins. I know. I know that. But same thing about this. It's another way. It's two sides to every story. TK, could it be that God's got me here today to talk to yeah, you, to tell you? that's what I'm saying. Yeah. It's another reason why you're here and why we stopped and why we're talking to you right now. It's because he made us. Well, he showed his love for you by dying on the cross. He took the bullet so you could go free. I mean, if he had to stay alive, I'd die on the cross for him too. Well, I don't know. He doesn't want you to die for him. He wants you to live for him. I know. I want to live for him, too. I mean, I'm doing the best I could. If he's going to help me in situations to get out of it, I mean, I'm still here, so that means he ain't helping me. Well, he'll help you. You get right with him, but you've got to get right with him first. And he may leave you in a gang to reach other people. I don't know. But yeah. what you've got to do is get right with him and start obeying the law and walking in righteousness instead of loving evil and doing what's wrong. Yeah. God will change your heart so you want to do what's right. Yeah. I'm willing to do that, but, you know, it's hard. I mean, well, you can't do it by well, yourself. Well, he'll help you. He'll become a new person in Christ. He'll give you a new heart with new desires so that you'll want to do what's right, not what's wrong. Do you have a Bible? Yeah, I have a Bible. When did you last read it? I, last time I read it, like a minute ago. Last time I went to church, like three weeks ago. A few weeks ago? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, please think seriously about what we talked about. And, and you guys, too. Uh, did you hear what we said? That if you as much as look at a woman with lust, you commit adultery in your heart? It's sin, and it'll take you to hell, and hell's a real place. No, this is this is heaven compared to hell. I'm not kidding. Well, you guys get right with God and begin changing this city, changing the world, and begin with yourself. We don't know how long we're going to be here. We yeah. can, as soon as we step out the court building, some yeah. can go down. As soon as this interview over, we we'll probably be getting... Right now, something can happen. You know what I'm talking about? This ain't no game. We out here doing it for a reason. We ain't got no read. Everywhere you move, they're going to... You want to be from the hood, no matter where you go. I don't care if you go way out of state somewhere, they still banging. Yeah, this but you know why I'm talking to you? Because yeah. I care about you guys. Yeah. I, I mean, you got to. You it's God sent you here right now, man. I mean, come on now. It's common sense. God, he had to sing you, my nigga. He trying to put something in our head. Yeah. And one day it might it maybe work, one day it not. But I know a lot of people hear what you telling us. And maybe maybe one day it's just going to click. Like, oops, it's time to do what we got to do. Because when people trying to live their child life the way they want to live, you know? When they can, get older, that's when they wrap all that old can up. Can I turn this camera off and pray with you guys? Will that embarrass you? Mm -hmm. no, you can can I, I do that? We need prayer. Okay. We need, we need prayer? Okay, okay. let me pray with you, okay? Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven, but he that does the will of my Father which is in heaven. Many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in your name, and in your name have cast out devils, and in your name done many wonderful works? And then I will declare to them, I never knew you. Depart from me, you who practice lawlessness. I'm telling you.